Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a self tan. I do have like towel on, so just want you guys know before you're like, oh my god, you're naked. No, I have a towel on. Choo. Okay, so today I'm going to be using Coco and Eve Sunny Honey in Dark. Um, yes, I messed up. So I've used self tanner before, and I've always messed up. Um, and they I had to reuse it and use it and use it and use it and use it. Um, but I exfoliated yesterday and I feel good. My skin's all soft. Um, they did give me um, an exfoliating mitt, which I'll show you guys what it looks like. It's just looks like this. Um, smells like the product. But anyways, um, I how it is and you just like scrub it you can actually use it dry and do this and it helps like take off the dead skin I don't have anything on my skin um, and you can also do it before you put your self tan on as well um, yeah so I'll just read what it says on here um, I did buy a lot more than this I had to leave it in my mother-in-law's house. So I did buy like the um, Coco and Eve Bally Buffing Sugar. Um, I used that. There was like an after um, lotion, everything else to prep it for this, which I have all of it. Hopefully I can show you guys all of that when I go back um, and do another one. But I didn't bring everything um, just because I didn't have a weight to weight my suitcase when I came back so yeah um, you can either use this dry or with that um, it's a soothing jelly mint for more a tank exfoliation with fine bristles to promote circulation and ensure product doesn't gather on dry areas if it's like a glove no worries about sliding off mid scrub I will tell you guys it is very flexible um, and it's very tight so when you put it on it just like wraps around your thing and you can just like move it and scrub it and you guys can see like it doesn't go any anywhere um, you know so yeah I thought that was pretty cool and like you have to pull it really hard to get it off um, all about the scratches on my face I was like wait a minute why these your nails loca anyways so I will be using lotion in certain areas like my feet my hands my ankle my knees um, I'm going to try and use as little as possible because when I tell you guys this stuff comes on it it comes on um, I also got this which is for um, I'll just read it so it's a pump pea size amount on the Coco and Eve bronzing foam on two brush applied to circular motions um, product until the area is suffocately covered and then you just rinse it until the water runs clean dry the bristles facing downwards and then yeah so and this is actually our deluxe vegan kabuki brush has silly fine bristles to sweep the from over those tricky to tan such as such as hands feet ears face helping you achieve and even head to toe put up for you guys this is what it looks like it is so super soft like it is so soft it is super 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 soft um like it's just so soft as you can guys tell i've never used this um last year i was just doing my legs and um feels so good to the skin anyways um but i'm gonna do like the head to toe this time i'm not gonna do my face i'm kind of skeptical about that um so i don't know we'll see anyways and then last but not least this is my mitten um same thing it has like the stretchable thing down here so when you go over it um i actually need to wash this but anyways um the inside has a like a protector I will say um, it doesn't 
let your hands get like a little like that. Um, it doesn't let the formula go through it pretty much, so your hand stands clean. Um, so yeah, we're gonna start with the legs because that is like the easiest for me to do. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna call my kid in and hopefully she can like record my legs. Um, and we'll go from there. I'll just put a little bit on. Okay, and it just like soaks into it. So yeah, let's get started. Me. All right, so I'm starting to just pop up here as you guys can see. Like, I have a line right through here and line right through here um, which is usually where I wear my um, bra so I'm wondering if, if it's just like that because of it but I'm doing all through here um, yeah like the lighting in here sucks <laughs> um, so I'm gonna have to go to a different lighting but I have done I don't know if I'm supposed to do this side or not but I did it all I'm about to do my neck now. Um, thankfully, it is um, I'm gonna do my face. Makeup can hide it, you know what I mean. So we're gonna go all out and do it all. Head to toe. I still got my feet to do. The little one did my back. So I think I have to go back and kind of like get over here a little bit more. I have to find a different um, mirror. <laughs> the husband's like, what did you do? Like, you know what? It's still cold. It'll last a couple of days. And if I mess up, well, you live and learn. This feels so wrong to do my face. <laughs> well, but put it on my like makeup. I guess. But yeah, um we shall see how it does. Um Right now, I'm just trying to get like where my hair is at mostly. Um, I gotta wash my hair anyways, so I'm not really too concerned. I am concerned about my eyebrows, but I set my eyebrows, you guys. I don't know. We're gonna find out. We are doing it, guys. I feel like it's gonna give me a mustache. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So I can use this on my hands and feet. So we're just gonna go all out. All right. I feel like the phone doesn't do it justice. Going all out. I use um a lot on everything else before I went over my eyes. Just kind of like trying to make sure I got every little creep. <laughs> oh my god. Well, go big or go home. 
I guess. Y'all think I'm putting on a lot and I'm really not. I'm using like a dab. <laughs> oh my land. I just want to make sure I got it all. Put it in my bag. And I look like a dirty little hobo on camera. And it doesn't look like this in person. Like, it just does not do it justice in here. So, yeah. I look like a dirty hobo. All right, so I have to fix my back now, and I'll catch you guys in a little bit. Like, all of this does not show. <sighs> mm -mm -mm. This does not show in my mirror. Like, <laughs> camera doesn't lie. <laughs> That's all I can think about. But yeah, um, my face is darker. Um, I don't see the white spot here or here um i see little spots here barely but it's like when i have pimples in that area um same thing up here so and then i have a little pimple right here but yeah like this is how it's looking on camera but it's not how looking <sighs> anyways all right, let me finish my back and I'll see you guys in a little bit. I still gotta do my feet, but yeah, I mean, some apples looking. It looks really nice in my mirror. Um, I'm really thinking it's the lighting. So yeah, hopefully I can get out of this bathroom and I will show you guys in better lighting, but looks like I'm just dirty. So stay tuned. So this is the before and that is the after it looks better in person the camera is just making it look all combobulated um so far my hands are turning out pretty decent um this hand's not anyways but this one is i don't know why i guess because i'm right dominant and my left is just like haha but yeah um we shall see but yeah so you guys can definitely tell the difference before and after between my feet. So yeah. I also believe if I would have gotten medium, it wouldn't be so bad on my skin. I feel like, you know, don't try to get something higher up because you think it's gonna be better on your skin. Actually get according to your skin. Um, like I said, I was very, very white. I got dark because I thought medium wasn't going to be as good, um, you know, like the in-stores. But this product's actually very, very good. Hopefully, when this runs out, um, I'll buy medium or, um, you know, uh, they don't ship to APO, so I can't, like, really order it and have it shipped to the house here. Um, so I would have to finish this regardless. And then by the time this gets done, hopefully I'll be back in the States to order more and have it sent to my mother-in-law's house and get medium. I'm so glad I did not get ultra dark. I just went one up because I feel like ultra dark would be like crazy on me. So yeah, I'm gonna finish the other foot and I will see you guys in a little bit. All right, so I am officially done putting it on my feet. Um, yeah, so we will see you guys in a couple of hours. I did kind of get it all over my towel a little bit. Um, but yeah, it was because I kept putting the bottle down. And yeah, so that's the old towel anyway. So I'm just gonna wrap myself around it. Um, it doesn't usually stain or anything like that, but I don't wanna put clothes on because I have to take a shower. And yeah, that's how it looked. Um, when my little one was recording, she was like, oh my God, it looks green. And I was like, wait, what? It looks green. And I had like looked on a bottle to make sure it wasn't expired or anything. And I'm like, does it look green? It's the lighting. <laughs> like she freaked me out. But I'm gonna actually wash these. Um, actually, I'm just gonna wash this one because the other two were not bad at all um but yeah so i'm just gonna wash it warm water and some mrs meyer cleaning to get this stuff kind of out so all right let's go oh it 
it does look green, like in the water. <laughs> I'm not touching it. I'll show you guys what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing, and I'm just putting some hand soap in there, which is, yeah. So yeah, just gonna let it choke. And as you guys can see, I actually got it in my sink by accident. Anyways, I'm gonna let that after my hands dry a little bit and after the shower, I'll clean up my sink and um, kind of slip them in, wash them there and because I don't want to touch it. Um, as you guys can tell, like, let me walk out of here, to be honest. I even brought my drink in here too. You guys are like, oh my god, no, it's nasty in the bathroom. But who does wine in the bathtub? Tell me the difference. Okay, just saying. I want to kind of put lotion on, but I feel like I should have put it on before I started on my elbows and stuff. But I just wanted to do it. This is actually the first time I'm doing it without the scrub. Um, because I was in the States over summer last year. Um, we left here in April and I didn't come back until the end of July, beginning of August. And it was already cooler here and stuff like that. So there was no need for me to do it. Um, so this is actually my first time without all the stuff that I usually do. Uh-uh, don't touch it, baby. I'm washing the mitten. Um, but yeah, so hot, right? She touched the actual, um, thing. It, so that'll go away in a couple of days. You're just going to be dark in that one spot. <laughs> So it definitely works um but this little you. one was like i want to be darker and i'm like no no mommy shouldn't be like you you don't be like mommy no yes so, mommy yeah let's go on a different lighting um actually my water is going out through the mitten a little by little so we're just gonna kind of take this and let's go see another lighting different lighting you guys i do look kind of dirty um like it's forming faster in some areas and then other areas it's like haha but yeah i'm like mm. this is natural lighting um i don't know guys i don't know how this is gonna look <laughs> hopefully makeup can fix it this is a better lighting it's not too too bad i feel like my nose is gonna be really really dark i feel like i don't know what happened between here and here i definitely got here but yeah, I got all of it. So we shall see. I'll show you guys what it looks like outside. This is what it looks like outside is Anz Bach, Germany. Hey. Oh, someone's going on a road trip. So I want one of them just to drive and sleep. I want like the RV just to travel and stuff. Just looking at my window and they're probably looking up like, who is this Oompa Loompa looking in the thing in the window? <laughs> oh my god, my friends! So I sent a picture to my husband and to my friend and she just called me and she was like, please tell me that's before you shower and not after because uh, I have some issues going on about this. I'm like, no, it's before. Does it look that bad, you guys? <laughs> Does it look that bad? Does it? Does it? Does it look that bad, guys? Mm. Anyways, um, so yeah, this is how it's looking. Everybody. My camera isn't picking it up. Um, uh -oh. But anyways, I guess we'll count this as like a good sign. I guess it's not too too dark. It's probably because I didn't leave it on either. Um, the only thing I can do is when I come back, I can redo it um to see if it'll come on a little bit darker don't know what to do with my hair you guys should i use my rubber on Oof. should i do my makeup first or hair let's do makeup first because i just have it all out of my face <laughs>
and then they put it in here. <laughs> okay, sorry. Anyways. <laughs> second i'll feel i'll show you guys what i'm gonna wear i don't know what i'm gonna wear i don't know we are heading out to go get the little one and we have to go to the commissary so yeah this is what i am looking like aries over there we're fixing to go and yeah so let's get on out of here good morning everyone i forgot to take off my makeup but today is a new day and i did get a little darker and i can show you guys where i messed up at it's on my legs but um yeah like i can kind of tell a little bit in my hands and then it actually did pretty good it's just i kind of messed up on my side area so that's difference in color as you guys can see, if y'all can see that, it's white and then it's tan. So, yeah. But, yeah. The video is super, super long, you guys. And I hope you guys don't mind. Um, I'm going to put a picture of right here of how my makeup was and the picture I had. It made my eyes look so beautiful. Alright, guys. We will catch you in the next video. Bye.